Well, I never thought I'd say these words, but Black China is going to Harvard. You got into Harvard Law? Plus, remember earlier this week when she said she was trying to change her ways? Well, she was not lying, because she's even thinking of dropping that major lawsuit she has against the Kar Jenner fam. On top of that, we need to talk about how Instagram had Kim Kardashian looking like a shady lady by unfollowing all of her closest friends and family. Thankfully, there's an explanation. Oh, and we must discuss the fact that Kendall Jenner and Ben Simmons are not broken up. He just thinks it's a bad idea to publicly date her right now. Can't say yikes enough on that one. We're talking all of this car dinner news right now, so stay tuned. How's it going, guys? I'm Madison Hill. We have so much tea to talk, but first, you guys know what to do. Click that subscribe button and the bell for notifications. That way you're always the first to know the latest. Okay, so first up, let's discuss what's going down with Kendall and Ben Simmons. Previously, I had told you guys about how a source spoke to the site Sports Gossip and revealed that Ben and Kendall Jenner had broken up. The source revealed that Ben and Kendall had both already moved on as Ben was seen having a woman at his apartment playing with his dog and Kendall spent Coachella sneaking and partying around with Anwar Hadid. Well, I'll be honest, the jury is still out if any lines were crossed between Kendall and Anwar. I mean, we know the two have had a thing in the past, so I could kind of see it, but on Ben's end at least, he has not done anything wrong. Now someone has come forward to sports gossip and explained that the woman who was seen at Ben's apartment was actually a girlfriend of one of his friends. This is a pretty reputable source considering the guy who's speaking out is the girl's real boyfriend. So yes, while Ben and Kendall are not technically broken up, that doesn't mean they're not having their fair share of problems. In a new report from Hollywood Life, a source revealed that for now, Ben is choosing to put his basketball team over Kendall and make them a priority because they're going into the playoffs. He's reportedly worried that it might not be the best time to be dating a Car Jenner, which I guess is understandable, being that the Car Jenner curse is kind of a thing. The source went on to say, quote, Ben is devoted to the NBA playoffs right now, and going out on dates with Kendall would be a bad look for a team that is looking to win the NBA championship. If the guy I was dating ever explained that it's not a good look to be with me right now, I would probably kick his tush to the curb. But Kendall isn't mad about it. The source went on to say that while her and Ben are still dating, both are on board with not being very serious. Kendall is busy with things and doesn't have a ton of time for Ben, and clearly he doesn't have time for her either. He wants to make sure his team knows he is focused on winning and not staying out late taking Kendall on dates. Which is probably a good thing since it sounds like his teammates aren't a huge fan of his girlfriend and the bad juju she brings. They don't want her anywhere near during this time. The source went on to say, quote, the team is very superstitious and they want to win or lose on their own play and don't want to add anything to sway the mojo. I'm not superstitious, but I'm, I am a little stitious. The source ended the insider info saying that this summer, these two will have time to reconnect. I just think it will be interesting to see if they last through this time of focusing on themselves. Okay, moving on, let's talk about Kendall's older sister Kim and that little Instagram mishap. Seemingly out of nowhere yesterday, Kim K unfollowed everyone on Instagram, including her family members. Fans obviously took notice and asked Kim what was going on, and she immediately freaked out because she didn't do it. She tweeted, OMG, what? What's going on? Shortly after that, she reassured people again that it was a mistake and she does not know why Instagram did that. She also took to her Instagram story and said, all the people I follow on IG are gone. Not sure what happened, I hope I remember everyone as I start refollowing everyone. To try and get this situation handled quickly and efficiently, Kim went straight to the source but still faced problems with the refollowing. However, as of this morning, I am happy to report Kim and the select group of people she follows are back to normal. So phew, Instagram should know better than to let a glitch affect the second in command of the Car Jenner fam. All right, now that we know Kim's IG is good to go, let's move on and talk about Black China because she kinda has a lot going on. Earlier this week, I filled you guys in on Black China's post where she essentially said she's been bullied, humiliated, manipulated, and discredited as a mom, and she's over it. She revealed that she was going to work on showing people more of her Angela White side versus Black China. And she's already taking major steps in doing so. Like first and foremost, she's reportedly thinking of dropping that lawsuit she has against the Carr Jenner family. Where do you guys stand with Black China today? 
Um, still in a lawsuit. Still in a lawsuit. That lawsuit being the one where China is suing the majority of the Car Jenners for purposely getting Rob and China's spinoff canceled, which meant she lost out on a big payday. In a new report from Hollywood Life, a source close to China revealed that things between her and Rob are really good right now, and that she would like to have that kind of a relationship with his family too. China reportedly wants the Car Jenner fam to give her another chance and has slowly been trying to mend things, but of course, it's a bit complicated given her and Rob's past. At this point, the source says China is willing to drop the lawsuit against the famous family if it means peace. The source said, quote, she genuinely wants peace with the Kardashians and she swears she has no ulterior motive for all of this. China just wants what's best for Dream. Like I said earlier this week, I do believe China is trying to better herself because aside from this, She's also going to Harvard. While China won't necessarily be packing up her things and moving to a dorm room, TMZ reports that she has been accepted to take an online course at the Harvard Business School. TMZ got a copy of her admissions letter and it seems she'll be taking a business analytics course, which honestly sounds like no freaking joke. It's 40 hours over eight weeks, so this mom of two is going to be busy with the books. All right, you guys, I'm ready to hear your thoughts on China taking classes from Harvard and potentially dropping the lawsuit against the Car Jenners. Will that bring peace? Also, thoughts on Kim K's Instagram debacle and Ben telling Kendall it's not a good look to date her right now. Let it all out down below. For more Car Jenner tea, check out our video on Jordan Woods saying she was bullied post scandal. And for more celeb news, subscribe to Holly Scoop now.